Hey guys, it's Sam, and today I have Chandler here with me. Hey guys. <laughs> I told Chandler that Shane Dawson made a video three years ago about the Larry Stylinson conspiracy, and you had no idea. I watched Shane Dawson, but like, I didn't know that he made about Larry. We have this video up today that we're gonna react to. I've seen this three years ago, but obviously I forgot everything Shane said because it was three years ago. This will be the first time Chandler is seeing this. I know, he's even a little ashamed. <laughs> he's like, I know guys, I'm sorry. If you guys have wanted me to talk about this, let's fucking do it. And that's the theory, Larry Stileson. So pretty much since the beginning of One Direction. I know he said it wrong. Larry is actually yes. dating Louie. And theorists have a lot of evidence to back this up. Here's just a few pieces of proof. Number one, the amount of times that they have either almost kissed or pretended to kiss or bit each other are insane. Here's bit just each other? What do you mean? <laughs> they call that a love bite in oh. Europe. I mean, I don't know, they could just be having fun and being goofy, but it's a right. lot of times to like almost kiss somebody. There's no feelings there. Um, number two, they were the only two people in the group to actually live together. And they've been pretty open about that. Just look at this clip where Harry said he wouldn't want to live with anybody else. You live with Louis, is that correct? Yes. Alright, he's not here, so you can give us the dirt. Is he the messiest? Yes. Does he do the washing up? Never. Does he make his bed? No, never. No, hopeless, hopeless flatmates. Would you want to be with one of those guys? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> so <laughs> What is your current favorite TV show? Well, I'm at home, I'm at work in London, but now I'm working on that next question. Well, let's get up some all of you. No, I'm excited to do it. Okay. <laughs> so, do you have. So, just there, you saw they said, oh, when we were at home, or we have too many in our house. I mean, mm -hmm. obviously, they're living together. Now, Louis has a story he tells about the first meal he ever cooked for a girlfriend, and it's some kind of chicken mozzarella dish. And supposedly, he says he only cooked in his whole life and it was for a romantic occasion. And then this picture came out. Harry Styles took a picture of him cooking the romantic dinner. They've also shared oh, on So that's stage. the they iconic were... Larry meal that you Chicken stuffed with mozzarella wrapped in parma ham with a side of homemade mash. Why you say it like it's some like, is that like what you guys say? When <laughs> it's you, a like, fucking hair. When, when you open up your cult meetings, like, alright guys, chicken mozzarella. <laughs> it's a freaking Harry Potter <laughs> spell. Like, instead of love it's, like, it's like, chicken stuffed with the mozzarella wrapped in parma ham with a side of homemade mash. Oh god, I can't. <laughs> so you made it for a romantic dinner and then Harry posted. Shane's doing a pretty good job so far, like, talking about it as if it's not stupid. Because a lot of people who. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm joking. laughs> Larry Silence and is the virus. If I didn't know about Larry, I'd probably look at this and be like, oh, well, I've seen bromances before, like, they played up for the cameras. And once people start talking about Larry and all that, they're like, oh, like, people, like, are finding out and, like, whatever. We're not gonna sit next to each other as much. We're not gonna touch as much. Like, we're gonna be, like, more separated. And people either thought they made that choice or their management did. If they're seen as gay, they're no longer available. Yeah, but wouldn't you think, like, some managers, once they notice that people, like, like the whole relationship thing, even if it was just goofing around, they're like, yeah, still continue being yourselves and, like, have it because, like, people like that. But modest management, who they were under, are a bunch of dicks. Simon Cowell was the. Makes sense. Yeah, okay, yeah. it makes sense. Just look at this one where they joke about giving each other head. Mm. Now, this next one is all Yes. Yeah. Yeah. He didn't know they were the mics were picking them up. Like I Oh, I, that's funny. If they said that in front of the cameras, it'd be like, okay, like you're just playing it up for cameras, but they, they were in the background. Sign language doing this means sweetheart or to make love. And they've been caught doing that to each other. Oh, they do a ton of sign language. <laughs> He 
She's like, yes. There's a whole Freddie is my queen video about Larry Silenson and sign language. And obviously mm -hmm. this one, like during concerts, because they can't go near each other, talk to each other as much, they do like the thumbs up kind of. Now on Harry's wrist, he got a tattoo that says, I can't change, which is a reference to something a lot of people in the LGBT community say. A few months later, Louie got a tattoo on the same wrist with little quotation marks. And when you put those together, well, then Harry got a tattoo of a ship, and then shortly after, Louie got a tattoo of a compass. Then Harry got a tattoo of a ship anchor, and Louie got a tattoo of a ship world. Harry got a heart tattoo, and Louie got an animal. Harry got a rose tattoo, and Louie got a dagger. And then Harry got a tattoo right here of a butterfly, and then Louie got a tattoo saying, it is what it is on his chest. Now that makes and those tattoos sense. go together, by the way. The actual, the, the actual tattoo artist. And on his sketches was the butterfly. Those go together. And above it, it said, it is what it is. Now, a couple other things is that here. What? Is those actually were a pair of tattoos at that tattoo place. Like, those actually went together, but Harry just got the butterfly and Louis got the top part of it. And they got them all at different times. They never got, like, a, they never went to, like, a parlor together. No, it was never together. It was, like, at separate times, but it was, like, consecutive, like, after. That's interesting. There's a whole Larry video called Larry Stevenson and then their tattoos. It goes into the. Wait, are they, like, like in the same, like,. Like arm and like placement, like I will, I will so say like that the wrist thing, the yeah. wrist, same wrist. Most of their tattoos, Harry's is on one arm, Louis is on the other. Like they're if they held hands, their tattoos then like match, up. match up. Got like a couple's tattoo. What's the heart and arrow? What you know how that? like a heart and arrow usually go together. You know like the oh. sign with the heart and an arrow pierces through. Oh okay. Yeah, heart and arrow. That's and interesting. Just the fact that he doesn't like gender roles. He doesn't like labels on things. He's very supportive of the gay community. He's, He's talking about Harry, right? right? Mm -hmm. Which this does not mean that someone is in the community. I just no, want to say that, like you're yeah. a big supporter. But I will say everything Harry has said, done, how much he supports the community, like how like how Shane said he doesn't like the whole uh, labels and roles and yeah. stuff like that. I think Harry's definitely somewhere in the community. Right. I don't want to say he's gay, but he could be bi, he could be pan, whatever. He's just Harry. He's just living his life. Yeah. That's all it is. I, like Harry. Harry. Yeah, Harry is just. Harry. But all that could just mean he's very supportive of the community. Yeah. Or it could mean that he is part of it. And the last little piece of evidence is from our very own second twins when they revealed on their channel that Harry and Louis are actually together. The whole rumor forever is that two of the guys are together. I think they're together. Fucking Ed. <laughs> Fucking Ed. Have you heard of the psychic twins? Yes. Perfect. Yeah, like, I know people say, like, they're, like, dumb and, like, you know, there, there's been some things they've said that are, like, eh, but, mm. like, they were spot on, I remember, with this whole thing. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you yes. think it happened? I did. Yeah. There was a romance, yeah. So there you guys go. We finally talked about it. And honestly, I believe it. And I kind of shipped it. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> you kind of shipped it. So, yeah, that was the whole Larry Stylinson part. Like, that's the only part I think he covered of it. You know what? I actually reacted to the Psychic Twins talking about Larry on my channel, and they responded to me. They actually commented on my video. The Psychic Twins. That's funny. That's just one eighth of the whole Larry thing. Like, there's evidence from 2010 to like, I don't know, 2017. Let us know down in the comments what you want us to react to next. Do you want us to react to a certain Freddy's My Queen video or another channel? Or should it be the video diaries? What do they do for the video? So they would update their fans or their viewers about how their week went on the show, uh -huh. like what performances they did, but they would also incorporate other funny things, like random things, and they would answer fan questions. It was. Oh. Just oh, okay. like, it was kind of just like it was just like for, with the fans. yeah, it was for yeah. viewers to get to know them okay. a little bit better. But it's like so funny. There's so many Larry moments in them. So that's why some people have told me like, oh, you should react to the video diaries because that was like the beginning of Louis and Harry's relationship. Do you have any comments about what you saw or any opinions? I think the tattoos are the most interesting factor. I don't know if it's because like I just really like tattoos, but it is really odd that the fact that Harry get it, would get a tattoo and then Louis would kind of like get a complimentary tattoo of it. That's like such a copycat move though. That's like, <laughs> yeah, I never sure. copy someone's tattoo. But like, I'm, like if it's like a relationship type thing, then sure. But not every single one. Like that just seems a little 
too weird in my opinion. And he didn't even show all of them. That was just the main ones. There's more. There's more? There's more. There's a whole like left and right comparison with, with a Louis side and Harry side and it like goes down. Like there's some on like Pinterest, Tumblr. Why would you do every single, not probably not every single. It's not every single. But it's like why would you do most of your tattoos like complimentary tattoos to like your lover or partner? After 2013, Louis and Harry were kind of distant. They weren't standing next to each other as much anymore. They weren't even speaking in public. They looked very like distant and all that. They would be speaking to each other through their tattoos, like so. Like Harry would get a tattoo, Louis, Louis would see it because people obviously posted it to express and then, their love, and then he would get a complimentary tattoo, kind of be like, "I'm still thinking of you." Yeah, without actually saying it. Yeah, because Louis oh. and Harry were technically silenced. We think by their management company, and if you're silenced, you're gonna do things like the sign language or the tattoos, or you're going to look at each other, like glance at each other from across the stage or across the room in a way that friends don't really look at each other. Like there's a, there's a video by Freddie's My Queen called Larry Silence and Body Language, like mm -hmm. their body language, how they look at each other. So this is only the beginning of what we're reacting to, getting Chandler <laughs> into, and obviously I don't want to force him, but I kind of technically am by making you watch videos. Welcome to the club. <laughs> oh God. Tell us down below what you want us to react to next or if you want us to continue this whole series because we think it'd be really interesting and fun to do. So leave all your thoughts down below and like always, I make a new video whenever I want. So like and subscribe. All my social media is down in the description and I will see you guys later. Bye.